Hi students, this is Alex here. In this video, we are going to see the introduction for the Taylor series for the function of two variables. Whenever there is a function f of x, y is given, we can expand this using the Taylor series about a point a, b or this can also be told as in the powers of x minus a and y minus b. So we will be using the Taylor series formula and we are going to discuss how to write that formula. The formula is f of x comma y is equal to first term is f of a comma b. The value of a and b substituted for x and y we get a value and that will be substituted here. Then second term is plus 1 by 1 factorial open bracket x minus a into partial differentiation of the function with respect to x at a comma b plus y minus b into partial differentiation of y at a comma b. Once if we know how to write this term, using this term we can write the rest of the terms. This we will treat it like a and this we will treat it like b. So the next term will be of the form a plus b whole square. So a plus b whole square we know it is a square plus 2ab plus b square and next to that we will be using a plus b whole cube form which is a cube plus 3a square b plus 3a b square plus b cube. So after this we have to put plus then continuation of this formula the next term will be 1 by 2 factorial. So if we had 1 by 1 factorial now it is 1 by 2 factorial. I told it is of the a plus b whole square form now a square this square this square will be in the form of x minus a whole square but we don't put f square instead it is double derivative partial differentiation of the x and it is in second order about a comma b then plus 2ab so 2 into we have to write x minus a then y minus b x minus a into y minus b then fx fy so that can be written as fxy of a comma b then b square which is nothing but y minus b whole square into second differentiation of f with respect to y at a comma b so we completed the next term then further as i told we'll be using a plus b whole cube form so plus now 1 by 3 factorial it is a cube first so cube of this that will be x minus a whole cube but f x x x about the point a comma b plus 3a square b that is 3 a square is x minus a whole square and b is y minus b and f x x y will come because the first term is square and this is power 1 so it is x x y about the point a comma b then next comes 3 a b square so this will be 3 a and b square y minus b whole square now f x y y because this is power 1 this is power 2 about the point a comma b then the last term is we have b cube so b cube once again we are going to use this form y minus b whole cube into f y y y above the point a comma b so plus dot 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 
this is a way to write the Taylor series formula. So the term starts from f of a comma b then continuously these terms will come. After writing this formula whatever the term we needed that is first differentiation with respect to x and y partial differentiation then second differentiation whatever the term we needed we have to find out separately and substitute in this formula and this gives the Taylor series expansion of a function with two variables 